Members of the civil society group say they decided to cry out as they felt the remand should be rescinded because they believe their members have not done anything to warrant such sanction. Kolai Dokpayi of the Talakawa Parliament, Kelly Osumbo and some developers say their members were protesting against the demolition exercise when they were arrested and charged to court. They called on the Attorney General and Commissioner of Justice to revoke the remand of their members and the developers in the interest of fair play. You destroy people's property. You damage the houses. You damage you more, more, than, more than 500 houses. They protested peacefully or peacefully. Hey, you are yeah. in the same court tonight. I detain them for another 14 days for peaceful protesters. Yeah. In fact, our democracy is dead. We just wanted to let the Attorney General know what we are passing through. The, the court is for everybody. The court is for the common man. Now, if the government now, the government now disobey the court order, what about the common man on the street? How are they going to do that? That is why we are here. They have been brought to a court and they have seek for a perpetual injunction to detain them for that for 14 days. What is their crime? Because they cry out to the world. Because they came up to protest in a very peaceful manner. That their buildings we are justly destroyed without compensation. The people came out alongside with some members of the civil society to draw the attention of the world to the injustice meted on the rat tax and the bob test, the evilies. They brought them to court they to get a detention order for two weeks. The police, through its image maker, SP Chidi Wambuzo, had earlier confirmed the arrest and arraignment in court for alleged unlawful gathering and other related offenses bordering on breakdown of law and order. A Fosa Wangwe reporting.